Hi friends, welcome to today's video. So today we are having a question on mensuration. So today's question is, the radius of a circular wheel is 1.75 meter. Find the number of revolutions that it will make in traveling 11 kilometer. So what is a given question? The radius of a circular wheel is given which is equal to, so given that radius r is equal to 1.75 meter. So what is the given question? You have to find out the number of revolutions that it will make in traveling 11 kilometer. So the distance uh, traveled in one revolution is equal to the circumference of the circular wheel. So that is a basic point you have to remember here. These kind of questions are very common for competitive exams. So the, here the only point you have to remember is that the distance covered in one revolution is equal to the circumference of the circular wheel. So here what will be the distance covered in one revolution? So here the distance covered in one revolution is equal to circumference of the circular wheel which is equal to 2 pi r. So 2 into 22 by 7 into 1.75. You know pi is equal to 22 by 7. So you will be getting your distance covered in one revolution is equal to 2 into 22 by 7 into 1.75 which will be giving you 11 meter. So 11 meter is covered in one revolution. So for covering 11 kilometers, how many revolutions are required? That is the given question. So revolutions required will be equal to 11 kilometer divided by 11 meter which is the distance traveled in one revolution. So you will be getting your answer as 1000 revolutions are required by this circular wheel to complete 11 kilometer. So how to proceed with these kind of questions? You know the distance covered in one revolution is equal to circumference of the circular wheel. So radius is given, you can easily find out the circumference of the circular wheel. So you get the distance covered in one revolution. So what is the total distance? Total distance divided by distance covered in one revolution will be giving you the number of revolutions required. The second question, find the diameter of a wheel that makes 113 revolutions to go 2 km 26 decameters. 113 revolutions are required by a wheel to go 2 km and 26 decameters. Then you have to find out what is the diameter of the wheel. So what is 2 km 26 decameters? You have to convert it into meters. So that is the first step. So 2 km and 26 okay 26 decameter decameter means what is the meaning one decameter is equal to 10 meter so 2 kilometer 1 kilometer is equal to 1000 meter so 2 kilometer 26 dec decameters will be equal to 2000 meter plus 26 decameters is equal to 260 meter so just the basic formula one decameter is equal to 10 meters one kilometer is equal to 1000 meters so you will be getting 2 km 26 decameters is equal to 2000 meter plus 260 meter which will be giving you 2260 meter. So in order to go 2260 meter the revolutions number of revolutions required is equal to 113. So what is the distance covered in one revolution it will be equal to 2260 divided by 113. 113 revolutions are required to go 2260 meters. So distance covered in one revolution is equal to 2260 divided by 113 which will be giving you 20 meters. So 20 meters is the distance covered in one revolution. You know that distance covered in one revolution is equal to circumference of the circle of or the circumference of this wheel so you will be getting 2 into 22 by 7 into r is equal to 20 meter or 2 r is equal to diameter so diameter is what you have to find out so you will be getting diameter directly so diameter is equal to 20 into 7 140 divided by 22 which will be giving you 70 divided by 11 or it will be equal to 6 4 by 11 meter so here also that basic concept the distance covered in one revolution is equal to circumference of the wheel is used to find out the diameter of this particular wheel. The last question of this video, a wheel revolves 28 times in a minute. Diameter of the wheel is 3 meter. 
find the time taken by the wheel to cover a distance of 5.28 km so it is given that the wheel is revolving 28 times in a minute and diameter of the wheel is given 3 meter so find the find the time taken by the wheel to cover a distance of 5.28 km so what is the distance traveled by the wheel in one revolution it will be equal to circumference of the wheel so that is a basic concept the diameter traveled by the wheel in one revolution is equal to circumference of the wheel which is equal to 2 pi r is equal to pi d where d is the diameter here diameter is given so i am writing the formula directly it is equal to pi d or distance traveled by the wheel in one revolution is equal to 22 by 7 into 3 now what is the distance traveled in one minute in one minute it is given it is revolving 28 times or it is making 28 revolutions in one minute so the distance traveled in one minute will be equal to distance traveled in one revolution into 28 since 28 revolutions are made in one minute so the distance traveled in one minute is equal to 22 by 7 into 3 into 28 which will be giving you 22 into 12 is equal to 264 meter so 264 meter is traveled by the wheel in one minute so in order to travel a distance of 5.28 kilometer it will be taking a time of 5.28 into 1000 divided by 264 which will be giving you 0.02 into 1000 which is equal to 20 minutes so it will be taking 20 minutes to cover a distance of 5.28 km so for these kind of questions the only concept required is distance traveled by a circular wheel in one revolution is equal to circumference of the wheel then you have to know the formula for circumference of wheel which is equal to 2 pi r or pi where r is the radius and pi d where d is the diameter of the circle thank you for watching